Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for April. And what do we got for the month of April for Leo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What do we got? What do we have for Leo, dear God, angels, spirits, and universe? I'm moving the table, so if the roses move, that's what's going on. Woo! Well, two of cups, two of cups about partnership. It's about a union. It is uh, unity, right? It's unity. It's deepening a connection, perhaps. You, you may be deepening a connection with somebody. You could be falling in love. Um, this is a, a loving... Uh, commitment of some sort this is somebody that you connect with so there's a there is a connection here where there's two people that really they enjoy each other uh they have a lot of similarities but they also have a lot of differences um it looks like it's a perfect match really it does i mean it looks like it's a it's a it's a beautiful kind of love really too i mean it's a perfect uh match I'm going to have to put it over here. So the two of cups, I mean, it, it really doesn't get any better than that. This is a partnership where there is unity, there is love, there is compatibility and happiness. So this is a, a happy opportunity to that is... Um, what is the word for it? harmonious okay there's a lot of harmony in this connection a lot of harmony it's beautiful so that is a beautiful love connection right there or partnership because twos are partnerships this is working with somebody that you are very compatible with and there's a lot of emotional support a lot of a tender loving care um it's easy it's very easy uh oh ace of cups reversed now the and that may, so the Ace of Cups reversed is a very emotional time. Um, now this is shutting down emotionally, or <sighs> an emotional blockage. Somebody, I'm gonna put this over here. Emotional blockage of some sort. Protecting yourself. Somebody is protecting themselves. They're protecting their heart. This is having their guard up. So we got somebody here that is protecting themselves, needing to protect themselves, or feeling defensive. Feeling defensive could be very emotional. You know, there is an uh, there is a partnership here, but there it could be one sided. I just got to be honest with you. I'm not sure what is going on here. We have a partnership where the, at least at one time there was some sort of unity. We're going to get a bunch more cards, but with the Ace of Cups reversed, there could be a lack of reciprocation now or a lack of love or maybe even falling out of love, wanting to protect yourself, guarding yourself because this is, or somebody, it could be the other person. Somebody is, is, um, guarded. Okay. They're guarded, protective. Ooh, look at this boy! You showing up in this reading? Now this is this is having strength and courage and confidence. Uh, very beautiful energy. Um, being very graceful, comfortable, strong. I I feel like we have this is. Uh, you may be pushing people away. You may be pushing people away. Uh, something to do with, uh, it's a very emotional, you may be working on yourself, regaining strength, protecting yourself. Maybe you're waiting for this special love because this is a special love. It is very special. This is a special love. So you may not be giving your heart away to anybody that isn't worthy. You may have multiple options. But this is somebody that is very worthy, very beautiful, very generous, very... Um, strong, very graceful, restraining yourself. You are restraining yourself from, 
just giving yourself away. I feel like you're doing a really good job if that's what you're doing. It's a very strong individual who is very powerful, very much in control. But this is this is crazy because this is a this is unable to master emotions and this is mastering emotions. But this is the past and we lead to the future. So in the past you may have been in a loveless situation where now you've got your guard up, you've done a lot of healing, you've done a lot of inner work, you're absolutely in a better place. This is somebody that has gained a lot of strength and wisdom too as well. And courage and confidence. So high confidence here. Working really, really, really hard. You may be focusing on your job, focusing on your money, focusing on yourself. It feels like you're really focusing on yourself. You're putting in a lot of effort into... Um, Mastering your emotions, I believe. I think in the past, maybe you were too, too emotional or maybe I mean, you could think of it this way. Now somebody is like, if you're not worthy, don't come near me. Maybe in the past, you got yourself in a relationship with somebody who wasn't worthy. Okay. Maybe that was the case because I feel like now, you know, you're putting in effort into... Uh, you know your worth, you know your value, you're very confident, you're very beautiful, you're working on your health, you're focusing on your health. Here, you know, there was a, a lack of love or unable to master emotions or emotional blockage. This is protecting, protecting yourself, not letting anybody near you. Or maybe that's what you, I think that's what you're doing now. It's like you're not just going to give your heart away to somebody that isn't worthy. It, this, somebody has to put in effort, um, a lot of effort. Victory, success, being recognized. Somebody is recognizing your strength. They're recognizing your beauty. You are definitely being recognized, Leo. You are. Somebody you work with may be interested in you. Just saying. You may be dealing with uh, somebody that you work with that is wanting you to open your heart to them, but you're guarded. You're very, very guarded. This looks like it could be a perfect match. Somebody that you work with. Or um, maybe this is somebody that you performed with before. If, if you've ever been in a performance, you may have performed with this person publicly. I don't know. But the Six of Wands, is this relationship, this partnership could lead to victory? It really, really could. Um, it could lead to success. It could lead to um, something stable. But you just have to put in effort into opening your heart and having faith. You need to believe and you need to let go of your fear. The strength is about let, letting go of fear. So I feel like you have somebody in your vicinity, maybe it's somebody that you work with or that you perform with or whatever, that is perfect for you, that um, sees your beauty. They really, really do. They really admire you. This person admires you. But they want you to open up and you're having a very hard time letting this person in. You are. You're having a hard time letting this person in. Um... But this person will do anything. I feel like the person that is trying to get you to open up will do anything to prove to you. This is help arriving. This is a blessing. This is the star comes after the tower falls. So you've had a tower moment, right? In the past, you've had a tower moment that broke your heart, that caused you some sort of emotional setback, that caused you to block to block your emotions right you've had this setback and now the help has arrived this is a blessing there's a reason why that other thing didn't work out this star the star is a card of unexpected help it's your fairy godmother answering your prayers this is a blessing in disguise you are being blessed with uh something that is very beautiful a beautiful connection here so this is truly a blessing. Now this is some this is a this is a star or somebody that is famous. So I'm not sure if if um you are dealing with somebody that is famous or somebody that is a star, but that could certainly be the case. Maybe you're a star. But this is um it could also be starstruck. You could be dealing with somebody that is starstruck. That just came to me. I don't know if you're dealing with an Aquarius. You could be. Um, doesn't have to be. But this is a dream come true. It's a wish. It's what you asked for. This is a partnership that you asked for. This is the answer to your prayers. Okay? It is. Consider this a big win. Some of you may be publicly recognized this month. 
If you are famous or something like that, you may be there may be some sort of public recognition that is coming that is in your favor. These people who you may be recognized for all your hard work, for the ski all your skills. If you are in the public eye, this is public regular uh, public recognition, and this is a star. This is a star. This is somebody that is famous. So somebody may be getting some sort of public reg recognition, and it could definitely be you. So I don't know. Maybe your job is going to recognize your hard work, your dedication, if if this is job related. Okay. Um, either way, this is guaranteed success. You have some guaranteed success here. Whatever it is, you have a partnership that is guaranteed to succeed. It is partnership, success, guaranteed success. And this may be a work partnership. If it's a work partnership or somebody that you worked with, maybe it's a work relationship or some, there's a relationship. So you met this person at work and it leads to something successful. So that's what I see. I feel like, um, you have some fear though. You have some fear, some fear of the unknown, fear of what is hidden, some fear of letting people in. Uh, I feel like there's going to be people pointing their finger at you because this kind of reminds me of that. You may, you may be, I don't know if you're going to be interviewed. Maybe you're going to be interviewed by somebody. Okay. Maybe there's news reporters here. I, I don't know for sure, but this could be like I, what I just saw was the news reporters with their mics. You know what I mean? And you may, you may be caught off guard. Okay. You may be caught off guard by somebody. Okay. Um, two of pentacles. This is some sort of alignment, making a choice, juggling. Choosing, needing to make a choice, going back and forth. Trying to find balance, needing to adapt. You are needing to adapt. You got to let something go that broke your heart. That's the truth here. There's no need to carry it. There's no need to hang on to it. It'd be a heck of a lot easier for you if you just held on to the stable opportunity and let go of the unstable one. You can't have both. You need to choose one or the other. And that's going to take strength and it's going to take perseverance and it's going to take some sort of discipline. So I think that you are in the process of healing from something that really hurts you and you have a new prospect here. That could lead to victory. This is this is like a dream come true. It really is. This is your answer to your prayers. I do see healing here. You've been putting in a lot of hard work. And I do see healing. And, and it's like a wish is going to be granted for you. A wish is going to be granted for you. Okay? It is. But until it is. You need to keep putting in effort to heal. Don't keep going back and forth. So this, this, this might not happen overnight because you haven't completely healed. You haven't. But you're, you're working hard and you're getting there. And, you know, uh, you, but there's still something you got to let go of. But, yes, a wish is going to be granted for you. Okay? It is. You're glowing you're glowing. You're shining very bright. You're right in your power. Everybody can see. Everybody can see your uh, increased vibration. They can. So keep that in mind. Anyhow, um, very beautiful. Very, 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 very beautiful. And I don't say that very often. So you have been working really hard and it absolutely positively shows don't give up and do not keep going back and forth there is something you need to let go of stop holding on to it you have the power to get whatever you want all you have to do is ask 
the good, the, the good Lord above. This is as above, so below. The universe sees the work that you are doing. They see your gentle soul. They see your beauty. They see your generosity. They see your kindness. They see what you are doing, and you are going to be blessed. Your hard work is going to pay off, so do not give up. This is a card of manifestation. The power is in your hands to manifest whatever you want at this time. You are manifesting uh, something beautiful. They hear your prayers and they are going to answer them. Keep doing what you are doing. You have a golden opportunity. Isn't that funny? Now one of them is covered. One of these pentacles. A golden opportunity that is coming to you. Something solid. Something stable. Something long term. But you aren't going to, be, to get it until you shed something in the past. Because the magician takes action to shed the old. To bring in the new. That is the meaning of the card. There is something you need to let go of. Because you got something bigger and better right in your hands. Let go. Let go to bring in the new. You must take action. You are in charge. You have the power. You are a very powerful. April is a very powerful month of manifestation for you. I think by June... Because I think it is June. I just do. I think it's about two months. You will be in a very beautiful partnership or starting a new relationship or uh, oh, wow, the first card is a two of cups. That is unity in a union. You will be uniting with somebody that is perfect for you. But I feel like you have to continue this process of healing. And I feel like this process is not just healing, it's manifestation. Uh, working on your health as well. It's like recuperating. It is, it's recuperating. You're recuperating from a loss. That Ace of Cups is here for a reason. And perhaps you are needing to, you know, push others away while you are regaining your self. Okay? So I feel like you are right in your power in April. I feel like you are in control. You are uh, becoming the best you again. You're rediscovering. You're healing. You're you're vibrating at a high level they're hearing your prayers they're seeing what you're doing and they're bringing you something uh, <laughs> that you asked for but the, during these next few months my advice is to continue to manifest and call in this soulmate and work on opening your heart and getting prepared there's something you need to let go of you know what it is Good luck.